Morning everyone, we're here, we're back at the Tramway Museum because they've got this seaside fun weekend going on. As you can see, we've got an uh, old style big wheel, we've got some tents, some ones with the like games that you can play, and there's loads more that we can look at. So just waiting for it to open. Opens at 10. We've got you a bit early, it's like 5 to 10 now. Um, and then we're gonna go in and I'll show you all the bits that they've got for this weekend. So just a quick reminder, there's the admission prices to get in. We have got to pay today, but then it will last all year, so we'll go through until next May. And then Ethan got a board up with a couple of the bits that's going to happen today, including Punch and Judy, bingo, face paints, balloon modelling. It's going to be so much fun. <coughs> right, we're in. The kids are already, like, fascinated by the ice cream truck. They're already wanting one. Oh, they've got a hungry hut. What's that got in it then? Looks like bacon, sausage, cobs, breakfast cobs, beef burgers, cheeseburgers, chip cob, chips and cheese. Not badly priced, all under four quid from what I can see here. Uh, except the burgers, they're a fiver. But that's a double, so I can't complain that. There's one of the trams out today. Um, my The tram that I really wanted to be out is out. Uh, we saw it go up earlier, so I'm very excited about that. Um, in fact, it looks like they're going to have four trams running because the red one's coming out also. I don't know if you can see down there. I'll just zoom in a bit. There it is. Looks like the red one's coming out as well. Uh, but the parade type one that I have been liking a lot and when we're going to the sheds, I always point it out to you guys. Um, that one is out. We saw it go up first. So, um, in fact, it's right down there at the bottom. It must have come back down while we were inside. And I don't think we're going to be able to see it, but I'm going to try and do the zoom. Bear with me. Whoa. Yes, there it is. Down there, that one. That's the one I was on about. That's the one I really like, and I can't wait to go on, and that's the one I've not been on. Um, so, yeah, it's one I've not been on that here. I've been on men many of these. We come, obviously, a lot. Um, and, yeah, I wanted to show you. I didn't show you last time when we came, because I completely forgot. But for your first ride of the day, they give you old pennies and half pennies. So you have to give these to the conductors and they give you a ticket, which is always fun. And the kids like getting the tickets. So, but first things first, of course, as always, nip down to the calf, possible bacon cob, drink and jobs are good in. Let's go. Well, I did it again, folks, with eight, and uh, I didn't video it. <laughs> but mum had a tea cake, had a bacon cob. Robin's eating some of my cob, because she didn't want hers. Riley has got it. It was like a cake with cherries in. And Riley had Rocky Road. Oh, yeah. And then tea and water again, because it was just really nice last time. So, um, we've been to the calf. I just forgot to film. Right, there goes my tram that I want to go on. We will get on that later, I'm determined. This looks so good. Let's watch it go up. 
yeah we will be on that one later that's the one i've not been on and i've been here so many times it's crazy that i've not been on that one but we've got the orange glasgow one out that's been out a few times the parade float as i like to call it that was out the last time we were here and then they've also got the blue one which i believe was also out the last time we were here so they've got a couple of similar ones the orange one wasn't out last time it was a different one um but come on now robin huh um but yeah they've got a couple out well i mean that total's four that they've got out today so they are expecting it to be busy got a bit of entertainment going on here let's go and see what else we can spy can spy some rides around this corner there we go this is the uh, the flea circus it's on at uh, 11 o'clock oh i can see the carousel yeah crossover good girl there we go It's definitely busier than it has been when we've previously been, but still not too busy. At least at the moment, anyway. Here we go, here's the carousel. Bad talk, really, just in case YouTube recognises it as uh, copycat content. Uh, but for this one, uh, carousel is for all ages. Those under 1.2 must uh, be accompanied by an adult. And all the rides are a pound per person today. Um, so that means they're all around at a pound per person and then there's also these little cars over here for the kids to go on just a pound per person again so not bad at all I think the kids are gonna go and get on uh, the carousel now Not a bad carousel to be fair, not a bad carousel at all. Um, and like you said, a pound a ride, you just can't complain at that. Normally when we go to these like old time fun fair type things, they're normally sort of you go and buy tokens and they're like so many tokens a ride. And the tokens are like a pound each and there's like three tokens per ride. But for it to be a pound a ride, you just can't even complain at that. Uh, so I will say it is Howard's old time fun fair that has brought the rides down. Um, and the kids I think are going to go on these little cars next. But they do love a good carousel. They'll be coming round any second now. Here they are. <laughs> They're off on the little cars again like i say pound a ride all the rides are a pound riley's loving his life love going around on these little things there we are and i like how each car's got a name so riley's in number one which is tim <laughs> then robin is in number six which is jake ever so cute they do love having a go rat Oh, Riley's got some sort of handle down near his legs. He's very excited about it. Mm. Can't beat a good kid's ride. And it keeps them entertained for a bit. Right, they've got another tram out now. Um, this is one we've not been on before. So we think we're going to jump on this one. As much as I really want to go on the green one that's now pulling in behind it. I think we are going to nip on the red one because we think that one's going to leave first. So we're going to go on the red one, we think, and then later on I will get on that green one. I'm determined. I will get on it. But yeah, so we're going to get on a tram now and um, head up to the top, see what we can find. There we go. This one's slightly different as well because the stairs are inside, they're not outside the tram. So I'll show you that going up will be interesting yeah, really. Are we going up there yeah sure ah. I've got your child in front of me go <laughs> on then oh. right, go. 
Oh yeah, downstairs looks quite nice. Sideways seats. Of course, we're going upstairs. Upstairs is much more better isn't it? Yeah, it's much better. Yeah, we're going upstairs. Upstairs is much more better. Yeah, we're going upstairs. Oh yeah, so you can. Right, sit down then. No Robin, are you coming up here? Sit with me. Come sit in the front look and you can kneel up and look out the window. Oh, oh, nice little seats. I can see. And we can see straight out the window. I haven't been on this one. Windows are cracked open because it's a nice sunny day. You're right. You don't need to take your shoes off. Well, well sometimes I take the brakes. We will get on that tram later. I am determined. I'm going to two rides. Okay, I'll start. We're going to head up in a moment. Oh, nice one. of the Feltlands as they're known at the entrances at either end as a normal typical tram car so this is one of a kind we have here and it's the only one that's left when was it built again? 1930 wow 1930? it came to Crouch in 1961 wow that's cool but I'm getting up at the final stop the final stop and then when Trestle we Right, well, that was fun. I hope you enjoyed that 
from the bottom to the top for a front window. We just got off at the Woodland Walk. My dad is still on the tram. He's going to head down to the bottom. Um, yeah, he's up there. Um, we're going to go down the Woodland Walk and just see if they've got anything fun out up on the lawn. Um, but yeah, oh, some shade. It's definitely hot today. It's already like 18 degrees, 19 degrees. So it's nice and warm. It's going to get up to 22, which is lovely for the last bank holiday of May. Um, but yeah, so Riley's just moving the mouth of this thing. There he is. It just opens and shuts this mouth. Let's see if she can do it. She couldn't do it last time. That's it, push. Hold on, she's like, take my hat off. Push. Come on, you can do it. There we go. She manages to do it one way and not the other. But she has fun, bless her. But yeah, we're going to go on the walk. Let's go. Right, we're going to go on the woodland walk now. So what I'll probably do is I'll probably film it and then speed it and put some music over it so you can see it all. We're going to head up and through. In the 
dark against it all But made it through the day Cause I found my way I found my way In bad times I know I'll be okay Cause I found my way Was the water mark? Hope you enjoyed that. Oh, it's like 12 minutes odd, so I'm hoping that when I do some editing, it'll go down to about six ish for you. But now we're just on the big open field, and the kids are sitting. Are you trying to sit? Can you do it? Oh, granddad's coming through. Through the trees. Looks like they've got the big lawn games out again, like the big dominoes and don't know what the building blocks are. I'll get there when we get there. But this is a really nice place to bring a picnic. Bring a picnic basket, blanket, sit on the grass, all they have got. So many tables dotted around. There's one over there as well. But this, yeah, this is a great place to have a picnic because the view from over here is lovely. I'll walk over and show you. Right, just look at this here. just beautiful can't beat the view in fact it just goes all the way down as well as far as the eye can see but yeah so this is a nice little place to come and relax as well and let the kids run around because it's just a big open field but you can see it all so you could be sat here and your kids can be running around over there and it's not a problem but yeah oh little robin's over near the drums there she is <laughs> bless her Right, our Robin's found the blocks. They've got letters on so you can spell words. Oh, hiccups. You can spell words out. Um, but she's just building with them. She's making a little tower, aren't you? Are you having fun there, little Robin? Building a tower? Whatever you want to. It's not full. No, not full yet. 
Okay. Oh. Oh, don't drop it. Uh oh. No, that one didn't want to stay on. <laughs> I think that's too big. Yeah, all fell over. <laughs> Come on, let's carry on then. I won't kick them. Push them with your hands. Yay! Right, let's go. Come on. Heading over to the maze. You have to jump. Oh, good step. Yep, keep yeah. going. Keep going, I got you. Nope. Wimp. <laughs> you wimp. <laughs> Said, no, just not got big enough legs yet. No, no. Oh, Alright, and then that's where we come out. Right next to the park. And we're going to have a walk over this bridge. You can come from down that way as well. We're going to have a walk over the bridge, see if we can see any trams coming up or down. It's a good tram spot in spot. So, so not quite on the bridge. The bridge is literally just there, look. But this is a perfect spot to spot trams. But unfortunately, there's none coming down now as I want them to come down. <sighs> Which is ever so annoying. But we've decided we're not going to go over the bridge because if you go over the bridge, you come, you go down this ramp and you end up back where we came in. So we've got to walk all the way down there. So instead, we're going to cut across the park and down some steps that are just like over there. So it's a shame they weren't a tram. But um, yeah, it's a good spot for tram spotting just up here because you can see them going down and coming back. So it's quite good. But, like I say, we're going to cut through the park, head down, and let's go see what else we can find. Right, we've come down to near the tram sheds. We've got a couple of others out, but they've also got one of these big music machine things that's on the back of lorries. And Robin's, like, obsessed. So it looks like they're moving another tram out to join uh, today's concession of trams. No? What are they doing with it then? Oh, what? Moving it around in the shed? Oh, that's it then. They're moving it around in the shed. Look, they're going to move the tracks over. Interesting. I've been on that one. Yeah, I think so. I have to go back through all of the videos and find out exactly which ones I've been on and which ones I am. But then again, I've been before, so before I was vlogging. But it looks familiar. It looks like it's one I've been on. So I'm going to say I've been on it. <laughs> right, we're going to head up to the bandstand area now and see what we can find up there because they've got some nice little things going on. There's like little tents and games. So yeah, we're going to go and see what's happening up there and see what we can find. Right, we're gonna go on the Ferris wheel now. I've got Riley going with my granddad and I'm going with little Robin. Let's go. Right, we're just on the Ferris wheel. We're up at the top. It's just loading on some people. Um, I don't know if you can see them, but my granddad and Riley's just there. Riley, turn around, wave. There he is. <laughs> I'm hoping you can see him. I'm with little Robin. Here we go. Hold on. Absolutely fine, look. Way. Wow, now we're right at the top. Can yeah. see everything from up here, can't we? There's a tram over there just heading up. Uh, there. 
And there's the bridge lot. You can see what I mean by it's a perfect place to spot the trams. The only thing I've got to watch as we're going round on this is they've got some lovely old fashioned music playing, hence the old fashioned, um, obviously, like rides. But it's probably going to be copyrighted, so I'm hoping that the swing through that we make, because I'll just I'll just show you one swing through, um, that it uh, it won't get copyrighted. Here we go, we're going down now. Woohoo! Here we go through the music. Here we are. Here we go. Here we go. That's it. Now we should just go up and round now. Wee! Do you like it? Is that fun? Wee! Is that good? Do you like it? Yeah, good! <laughs> Whoa! Right, we've gone for dinner. I've gone for chips and cheese, and this tray is huge. Easily could quite happily share with an adult and a child, but I mean, I'm sure Robin will want some chips and cheese, not gonna lie. But it was only £3.50, and then I got a can of pop, so it was £4.50 in total, so I can't really complain with that, to be honest. Right, Robin's helped me eat my chips, but I couldn't finish them all. There was just too many. Too many chips, weren't there? And then Mum's got ash brown cob, which wasn't on the menu, but she asked, and they said that they'd do it, so that's even better. Uh, my dad had a sausage and bean. And Riley... Oh, no, Riley's burger's falling out his cob. And Riley had a burger. And then we're going to go up here and see what we can find. Right, they're going to play on this game. This was three pounds. You've got to get a different, a different colour ball. So it says catch three different colours, and you can have any prize. So get one colour. Come on, catch one. There, stop, stop, stop. Right, yeah. So now you need to get a blue or a green. You can't get a red or a yellow. You have to get a blue or a green. So go for the blue. Blue, green. Don't get the yellow. Don't get. The yes, we've got a blue. Yay! Wait, yeah, wait there then. She'll come around in a minute. Right, Robin, what teddy are you having? She's letting you have a teddy. Which one, the monkey? Which one? Have a walk around. You have a look. So we have also got a sandpit beach, what they're calling. A couple of chairs around the outside for adults and then it's just like a square box for all the kids to play in. Uh, there's lots of kids in there so we're not going to go up there um, the kids have got a sandbox at home if they want to play in the sand they can do that later um, and then over in that hall is the bingo uh, it's bingo 11.45, 12.45, 1.45 and 2.45 so yeah they've got loads of bits and pieces on plenty of seating again like I say did you have fun on that game? You won a little monkey didn't you? granddad took it back to the car along with Riley's green ball that he got. Um, but yeah, we're going to go and have a little bit of a walk. Perhaps get on another tram, maybe go to the park. Who knows what we're doing. But you'll soon see in the next clip. Right, they're back on here. My dad's took both the kids on. They're coming down in a minute. Here they come. Yellow one. Yay! <laughs> Robin was like, I want to have another go. I want to have another go. So my dad said he'd take them on and obviously because it's quite a wide seat you can do two kids and one adult so it's not too bad at all and at a pound a ride you just can't complain so three quid to go on this for all three of them is amazing you just can't complain right guys it's happening we're going to be getting on the tram that i want to get on i'm so excited i can't wait all right we're going on it even still says Pleasure Beach up there at the top as well. How exciting. It's a different entrance again because it's in the middle of the tram. Robin, come on. Riley, let's go this way. No, I'm still there. Riley, Robin, wait a minute. No, you're all right. <laughs> hey, well, you can see the Pleasure Beach sign a bit better now. I've sat down. There it is. Oh, Pleasure Beach. 
very excited. Oh, yeah, do you like this tram? Excited? They're talking about moving the seats over. I'll show you that when it gets time to it. I won't record going up again because um, I've already done that. So I'll show you the seat changeover. Right. Wait a minute. There we go. Right, Riley, you need to come round. You need to wait a minute for us. We will do ours in just a second. Right. Go on then. Can you push it? There we go. Get in then. Move over. And we did it. We did it. <laughs> um, right, we stopped off for ice creams, but I kind of already ate mine. <laughs> Riley's got a tub with a flake, yeah, Robin had a tub with a flake, Mum had an ice cream waffle cone with a flake, Dad had normal cone with flake. You had waffle cone with flake? Yeah. Not bad. How much was the old dad? For all of them. How much? £24 for two tubs, three waffle cones and a normal. Can't complain, not too bad. Could have been worse, I suppose. Also could have been better. But it tastes nice and that's the main thing. Right, Robin's going to try lemon. Bye. Uh, yeah. But you need to video me no? with the lemon. No, thank you. You need to video me with hey, the then. lemon. I <laughs> Pepsi is dark in colour. I don't want it back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're in the pub if you can't tell <laughs> I've got the kids a Sprite Mum's got a white wine and lemonade Even though it's in the gin glass But it is white wine I have got gin My dad went with our vlog of And my granddad got a pint of mango cider I meant a pint I know what I meant It's, it's, it's only half full with lager The rest is lemonade <laughs> I know what I'm saying, I promise. I've only had one. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> right, we've met the chimney sweep. I don't know what Auntie's taking a photo of me for. She can take me home if she wants. <laughs> oh, that's a good colour. Oh, yes. One cool. big puff and it's all over. Those are quite easy to make. Are there? You have to watch and find out. Nothing is ever as easy as it looks, young man. Oh, say you thank, thank you. you. What do you want? Do you want a puppy? A puppy. A puppy. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't hit no bricks, it might pop. Oh, there we go. Say thank you. Come on in, awesome. <laughs> oh, is that cute? Go on, doggy. Come on, then. Take it on the ride. Take it on the ride. <laughs> it does look good. Yeah. Wow. This one. Is it cool? Yeah. yeah? Do you like your doggy? Yeah. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Got his tail. Oh. Okay. You got a tail. <laughs> Loving life. Right, the kids are going back on the car ride. Another pound down the drain. I've been given the balloon animals. And off they go. Robin's obsessed with these little rides, it's crazy. Here they come, round again. <laughs> Loving life. Right, we've been followed up by the promenade float. And they're just all turning their seats over. 
so I thought I'd get you a view of it. A minute, look, they're all changing over their seats now. Got to change sides. Those ones are slightly different, they sort of do a up and over rather than just a push and switch. It's quite interesting. And now he's going to hook back onto the wire. Up there. Good hooks then. But yeah, so that one's going to leave first and then we will leave. Um, and I'll pop in a sped up video of us going from the top to the bottom. fun except Robin popped her balloon dog as she was climbing up the stairs to get on like as she put her hand down on the floor with a balloon it popped so she was a bit gutted yeah but Robin popped her so she wants another one so I need to find the man again we'll see Hey Robin, where are we going? To park. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, so they went and had a, one more ride on the carousel. And now we're going to head up to the park. park. Yes, we're going to the park. 
aren't we? Yeah. It's going off of your hat. It's like half covering your face. <laughs> you can see. Okay then. Apparently she can see. So yeah, we're going to head up to the park. So I'll pop in a little bit of footage of that. But then I think we're going home after that. It's been a long day. I mean, it's nearly... We got here at 10. And it's like quarter past four now. So they'll probably get half an hour in the park. And then we'll head home. to be fair it's been really fun absolutely worth coming down i mean a pound a ride you just can't even complain at that um kids have multiple rides big wheel twice carousel twice and car ride twice so they did end up going on all the rides twice uh we managed to get on three of the five trams uh which i was happy with and they played on the game got balloon animals even though robin's managed to pop um but no all, all over it's been a great day um uh, absolutely recommend coming if they do another one of these like summer seaside events totally worth it yeah but that's everything for today guys thanks for watching and we'll see you next week with a new vlog like comment subscribe i'm coming bye bye bye